Hi, this is Linda, and welcome back to Hands That Cook. Today we're going to make a, a cake for Father's Day, or any other time you want to. Um, I already got my cake mix in the... in the... Um, mixer and I'm trying to find the box but here's another one this is it right here perfectly moist butter golden cake by Duncan Hines you can use any brand you want to this is what I chose to use okay um, I've already got that in there um, I'm going to add one cup of oil, of vegetable oil, corn oil, doesn't matter. Four eggs. I'm going to put my Now go ahead and heat your oven, preheat your oven to 350 and grease and flour a 9 by 13 pan. You know, I know on, on a special occasions you've got a lot of preparing to do, so that's why I chose an easy cake. Because there's so many other things that you've got to do. I've got all this mixed up in here. And now I'm going to add... Uh, it's supposed to be 11 ounces, but I've got 15 ounce can of mandarin oranges with the juice. I'm going to add them in there. And because I wanted um, larger pieces of orange in there is why I got my cake mix mixed first. There we go. If I had put them in earlier, um, they would have been all beaten up, beaten to pieces. So I waited because I want pieces of orange in this cake. And this is a mandarin orange cake. Here's my nine by thirteen that I sprayed. Um, let me get a spatula. Now this is going into this three hundred and fifty degree oven for thirty five, anywhere from thirty to forty minutes. You know, so let's 
let's see here. Let me take my beater off. And get it in the sink. And, and this is very liquidy. So I want y'all to be aware of that. Here we go. And you know how to test a cake to be sure it's done. So, you know, get a tester and if it comes out clean when you put it in there, then it's done. So anywhere from 30 to 40 minutes, maybe 45, I'm not sure how long it'll take. And then I will bring you back when it's done and cooled because we've got to make the icing. So I will see you back shortly. We're back. My cake took 35 minutes in the oven and it's just about totally cool. Looks good, doesn't it? I'm going to move this aside and we're going to fix the icing. Now, by the way, the cake the mandarin oranges went in with the juice. The juice also went in. Alright, this is a 20 ounce can of crushed pineapple. With the juice into that I'm going to put a four serving size of which is 3.4 ounces of instant vanilla pudding. I'm going to put that in. Get it mixed up. And into that is an 8 ounce container of whipped topping. Thawed. You're going to put the entire 8 ounces in here. This cake will have to be kept in the refrigerator because of this whip topping.
There we go. Mmm. This looks so good. All right, now I'm going to bring the cake back over. And we're going to ice it. Mm. Sammy, I'm filming. Oh. Well, you aren't talking. Oh, boy, does this look good, y'all. I'm sure Sam can't wait to taste it, can you, Sam? Looks delicious. Mm -mm -mm. Go get a little saucer so I can cut this. Goodness, does this look good? Mm. All right, let me get a little knife. See if I can get it up with this. Oh, we look at that, y'all. Yeah, get that on the plate. I'm ready to try it. Try it. Now, what is this called? Excuse 
excuse me, this is a mandarin orange cake. Will you set the cake over mm. on the stove? Look at that, y'all. Yeah, that's, that's like a perfect dessert for the summer. Are you going to move the cake or not? Yeah, when, you'll have to move a little bit. Got your fork. Yeah. Mm mm. That's me right there. I love that. Is it moist? Oh, very, very light. Can mm. you taste the oranges? Yeah. Taste pineapple. Well, the pineapple's in the icing. The oranges are in the cake. Perfect dessert. Did you say it's perfect for Father's Day crowd? Oh, yeah. Or anything. Actually, any crowd. <laughs> well, why are you standing over me? Mmm. Yeah, that's delicious. Well, y'all, mm -hmm. this is an easy dessert. So on top of all your other chores for Father's Day, well, you don't have to have it Father's Day, but it's an easy one. You can make it the day before. Try it. I know you'll love it. So thank you for coming in today and spending part of your day with me. Like and subscribe if you haven't. Until next time, you all take care. And God bless every one of you.